Well, you might not have even realized it, but I was gone for a little while. Uh, I'm back now. I had to unfortunately take down my channel, the whole YouTube channel for, I don't know, it was maybe a week or so, maybe a little bit more. I, I don't even quite remember. Unfortunately, that means I lost all of my subscribers, which I didn't know was gonna happen, so that sucks. I'm sorry, hopefully you could find me again. But I had to take it down because I'm at war with Tesla right now, unfortunately. I'm currently working with a lawyer, so I can't get too into it yet, but I will have stories to come, so feel free to resubscribe, because it's horrible. If you watch my other videos with Tesla service and all those problems, then you kind of know what's going on, but I don't think anybody could have guessed how much worse it was about to get. I just got my car back two days ago. I haven't been able to drive this car for a month. So I'm very thankful to have it finally back. It's perfect, it's working. The car is still great, and in all my videos, I say how wonderful the Model X is, and it still is the best car I've ever had in my life. It is a phenomenal car, but Tesla service is the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. Absolutely appalling. I can't wait to tell you guys the story. It's just I have to okay a few things uh, through my lawyer before I, I get too much into it but I definitely think that you're gonna to wanna to subscribe and you're probably gonna to wanna to hear about it. Uh, I also have to apologize for my shaggy appearance and my long hair. I should have gotten a haircut a long time ago and it's about a month past due because like I said, my car has not been drivable. So I haven't really been able to leave the house. <laughs> Today is one of only a handful of days that I've been able to leave my house in January. So I haven't got a haircut in a very long time. I hope to get that done tomorrow. I also wanna let you guys know that I am planning on driving this car, or maybe a different one, I'm not quite sure, hopefully this one, uh, down to Austin, Texas for Fully Charged Live. I had a video that I was going to release about me traveling down there, but with all this crap with Tesla and everything and, and taking my channel down for a little while, I scrapped that whole video. I really wasn't too into it. Unfortunately, the last month has been pretty much the lowest time I've ever had in my life. It's been really depressing, disappointing, and scary because they're holding all the cards and they are really putting me through the ringer. You're gonna be shocked what they did to me, but I, it really hurts because I've been a Tesla fan since the beginning. I host the local National Drive Electric Week event for five years running now. I've really been a huge EV advocate and I'm always trying to get my friends to buy an electric car. So this has been my world. This has been everything to me. The Tesla Model X has been my dream car since it came out and I've really just wanted to own a Tesla. With a Tesla supercharger network, it's phenomenal. You can go anywhere. There's like, there's no compromises with range anymore. But with all this crap, I can't trust Tesla at all. I, I despise them. They really screwed me over big time. And I, like I said, I can't wait to tell you guys and, and get the word out there because it's just so horrible. But anyways, thanks for checking back. Um, I'm looking forward to moving past all this so I can have more positive videos. I never ever thought my channel was ever gonna go on this negative spin. This is never what I wanted. This has just been my experience with Tesla and Tesla service and I feel like it had to get out there, unfortunately. So stay tuned for more. Feel free to like, share, subscribe, all that stuff. But thanks for checking in. See ya.